God damn it. At least there's some ammo right here. Convenient, just in case you're out, which I am. And also, I have no gold ammo, so that's cool. Although, they might use the same ammo I'm using right now, but I don't. I doubt it. Anyway, I don't need the ammo for the gold. I mean, I don't need the golden guns to shoot. I need the golden guns for that damn door in the fucking palace. Fuck, watch out. Fuck you, zombies. Get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Alright, is he dead? No, he's not. We're gonna waste all of our ammo on the first two zombies we see. Awesome. It. Fucking die. Thank you. Right? Yes. Okay. Alright, so now that we've destroyed those fuckers for now, where are we going? We're going down the hall? Let's go down the hall first. What do we got down here? Another save point, maybe? Possibly? Could be. Indeed it is. It seems to be a picture of this room. You don't say. <laughs> That's kind of a roomception move. There's the blue emblem that we need. That's cool. Man's portrait is displayed here. Also cool. There's some ink ribbons here. Now it's not exactly a normal save room, but it is a save room, so we're gonna use it. Cause no one wants to redo things if you don't got to. No you don't. No you don't. Alright. Coo coo! Kachoo, baby. Coo coo, kachoo. We saved it. Coo coo and kachoo. What? All right. Is this room? I feel like this room has more to it than meets the eye. There's evidence that a picture was hanging here. Oh, I see. You can see what picture was there before. It was like a red picture. Maybe we'll find a red picture to put there later. Smart. Smart. I'm a genius. Which is a classification of or classification of organisms that all belong to the same relative genome, or something like that. I can't remember. You are on the first floor. Go to B floor. Oh, this is the elevator that we were on. Or yeah, it is. It is. It is. It is. Okay. Um. Yeah, this is probably the right way to go for now. Cause there's ammo in here, which I will take gladly. Alright. I actually wanted to come back down here because there was stuff down here. I, I, there was grenade ammo and who knows what else but I didn't get a chance to really look around. I just kind of said fuck this place and I was outie. It's over here. Over the grid there's an indigo blue card reader. Okay. That's cool I guess. Indigo blue card reader. Yay for that. Gas for the freezing device is leaking out. The ventilation device is working. Okay. Something tells me if the ventilation device was not working, we would be dying in this room. Noted. Alright, this is where those grenades were. I'm taking them. Anything else of use? There was a card reader in here, I believe, as well. Also, there's a door here, which I didn't even try to open with the dude. Though it may not have been uh, accessible with the dude. I didn't even try. Ah, oh, fuck. Maybe I should have. Alright. Going back out. I haven't got the ammo for those fuckers. Those guys are going to have to wait a minute. I saw grenade rounds in there, too, which I definitely want. There's also a shotgun in here. Oh, what? Card reader blue? No, it's blue. We need a blue card, you fuck. Let's go all the way back to the beginning of this area where we took like that little lift and took us down here. Maybe there was something back in this room that I could that I could have get. Nope. Dude, we need an indigo blue card, man, and then we'll have a shotgun, man. I want a shotgun, man. Oh man. What a cock tease. What a cock tease this game is. I have a fucking... All these bolts, and I have grenade rounds, but I ain't got those guns. But I do have... Um, but I'm about to get a fucking rocket... Or a, a goddamn shotgun if I had the ammo. Or, I mean, if I had the uh, card. Actually, let's fight these guys. I forgot I just picked up some bullets out of the mouth of that thing. I really want to see what's in here. If there's just grenade rounds, I'm going to be mad. I'm hoping there's something else in here. Like, I don't know, the 
blue key card? That'd be nice. Fucking die. Oh my god, there's another dude in here? Oh my god. I'm not gonna be able to kill them. I'm out. I'm out. Is that all that's in here, really? Oh, it's, and it's locked? Are you kidding me? What the fuck else is in here? Okay, there's more ammo in here, at least. Hold on. I don't really need to do this this way, but at least we can start firing right away. Well, I told you this is becoming a true horror survival all of a sudden because we are very, very low on ammo. Chemicals used for something. That's it? There's some handgun ammo. There's some grenade ammo. That's all that's in here? Are you kidding me? Handgun part placed on the work desk cannot be used with the M9. Fuck! So there's a handgun part for a gun we don't have. Well, that's just garbage. Why can't we take it with us and maybe use it on a gun we will get later? Alright, so all these things that say with a secured with a simple lock, I'm assuming when we get the lock pick, whenever that is, we'll be able to open that shit. Anyways, awesome. Don't have the blue card. Don't have a lock pick. I don't have shit, man. I don't have nothing that I need right now, man. I ain't got nothing that I need, man. Nothing that I need. Ain't got nothing that I need, and I'm very sad about that. Very, very sad about it. Almost gonna cry about it. Wait, is this a path over here? Oh. Looks like there's a path there. Guess not. Alright, let's head up to the second floor then. What you gonna do? Cry about it. I feel like I've made a lot of progress in these few episodes that I've done in this game so far, but I also feel like I am only super fucking my own self because of how much handgun ammo I've used and how much knife I haven't used. Mostly because I have no other guns right now and I'm kind of fucked without them. Another blue card reader. Great. Awesome. Wow. Like, totally freaked me out. I mean, right on. Don't you wish you had one? San. Wait, was there another door in that hallway? Hold on. Oh, no. I'm thinking of... Where at? Wait, where am I? Sorry, I'm looking at the wrong part of the map. No, we're good. Never mind. I'm tripping. I'll be tripping. Don't be tripping. Stop that tripping. No, don't be tripping. Okay, so there's a lift there that I... Okay, well, that was pointless. Gotta love the pointlessness. Wish I had the indigo card right now. Right about now. I'm a little bit sad. <sighs> okay. Well, looks like we gotta go the way with the dog. Awesome. Or dogs, I saw more than one. This is gonna be super fun! Because I love dogs. Mostly because one must love dogs. As the movie tells you to. Because if you don't, you're a horrible human being who hates puppies, hates America, hates dogs. All right, Steve, man up. Time to sack up. Time to pussy up. All right, well, whoa, 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 what? I was just pressing the square button. That was luck. That was absolute luck. I was just walking around mashing the square button, hoping to interact or find something just out of habit. And lo and behold, got myself some more ammo, which is very much appreciated. As for these dogs, I'm thinking about just running by them if I can, maybe, hopefully. Wait, hold on. Do I have... I don't have any more healing, though. I might have to kill them. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh, my God, with the aiming. Girl. Girl, please. Oh, my God, dude. I'm gonna die. I've wasted way too much ammo. Let's... I'm dead. I'm dead. I think the dog just killed me, no? I'm about to die, I think. Uh, I am also pressing the wrong fucking buttons! Alright, where the hell am I? There is only one door to go in. It's right here. Fucking go in it. I'm about to die. There is a thing on the ground in there, don't get me wrong. I wanted to pick it up. But man, I was getting my ass handed to me, and I think I'm about to die. Oh my god, are we in the area with the damn worm again? That's not where I want to be. This is not a place that I want to be right now. Where the hell did the, uh... 
Because I got this blue thing. I can't remember where that was. Wasn't that over by the dude where he was shooting at me with the sniper rifle? I think so. Run away from the worm. Big worm. Oh, God. <laughs> that worm, dude. Fuck that guy. Alright. Wasn't this door... Ventilation of biology room not complete. Lock could be released when ventilation is complete. Okay, so that shit needs to be vented. Okay. Um. I never did go up those stairs, did I? God damn it. Okay, and let's see. That one room had a thing that we needed to unlock something. I think where we want to go is this way, but I don't think we can go this way right now. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Apparently we can. Sweet. I want to go outside where the dude tried to snipe me because I'm pretty sure that's where the blue emblem or the blue shield shape thing was. Oh god, there's dogs out here now? Fucking A. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Unless dogs can't use the stairs, then I'm okay. Yes, blue indigo plate. Use it. Use it. Did it. Nailed it. <gasps> yes, the blue key card. Is that... Oh, please tell me that's what that is. I think that's exactly what that is. Oh, God. Yes. The shotgun is within reach, my friends. Oh, it is. Oh, it is. Oh, indeed. Indeed it is. It's exactly what we need. All right, so what was going on up here in this area? Like, was there anything else up in this, this spot where I am right now? If I go... Oh, sorry. If I go in this door... Okay, this led to a save point. But that door... I'm assuming he won't trap me again, will he? I don't think he can, right? Hmm. I would like to go to the save spot and get a healing thing. I'm pretty sure I can get back to the shotgun pretty safely, though. As long as I get past these dogs. Just gotta get past the dogs. <laughs> Oh yeah, we're dead. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. I should have went through inside. Oh my god. I am so dead. Those other dogs are gonna get me. I'm gonna die right now. This is about to be a game the fuck over right about now. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do right now. I'm I'm so fucking dead. I'm so fucking dead. Um, yeah, I literally have nothing I can do to save myself, I don't think. I can't think of anything I can do to heal myself. Except for get to a fucking item box, which is what I should have just did. I should have just went down the hallway, grab my damn one green herb I have. Now I gotta contend with this motherfucker and hopefully not die. Oh jeez, please don't, please don't, I'm sorry. Don't, 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 oh. Okay, that guy was the least of my worries, I think. I think the dogs are gonna be the death of me right here. Go, 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 go. Woo hoo hoo, got it. Glad they weren't right in the way. I also really wanted to pick up that thing on the ground, but I, I keep avoiding it. Oh, dude's gone. Dude is gone. Should have known he'd be gone. He and he took his dad with him? Body's gone. That's not creepy. I stink. Whatever. Take your dead dad with you then. Have fun together, wherever you may be. I really need an item to heal, like, badly. Warrior needs food badly. All right, we're gonna start with the basement floor because I want to get that shotgun in my hands right the fuck now. Please, we need it. Please don't put any enemies in my way before I get it. Please, don't give me anything. Don't get. Don't. Don't throw me any curveballs. The game probably is like, yeah, they're totally gonna go get that shotgun now, no matter what. Especially if they saw it earlier. So let's unleash hell. Please don't unleash hell. Please don't. Just let me get let me let me get the shotgun in peace. And then you can throw whatever you want at me, because I'll have infinite protection for six bullets and then I'll be out. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Let's let's indigo card read that shit. Hell yeah, baby! Mmm, shotgun, it tastes so sweet. Oh, okay, that's not the shotgun. It's a grenade launcher. Whatever, it's a gun. Better than the fucking handgun we've been carrying around this whole damn game. Now that we have the grenade launcher, I feel much 
more equipped to handle whatever I need to handle. Oh, fuck! That scared me. Okay. <laughs> uh, how I didn't die just now, I don't know. But that literally scared me. Okay. <laughs> oh, fuck. That was a legit oh, fuck. If you couldn't tell by how loud it was. All right. Well, we're not going that way yet. I want to. Someday. But probably never. It's on my list of things to do from now until never. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna head up to that other indigo door. Because I wanna know what's behind that door. And then once we do that, I don't know what we're gonna do. I mostly just need a healing thing. Right now we're kinda on the run until we find a healing item. Because we are literally about to die. Literally about to die. Can't believe I didn't just die from that claw in the fucking dome. I, like I said, I'm going for it, man. I'm just going to go for it. If I don't die, I don't die. I'm just going to feel proud of myself for literally playing the survival horror and not being a bitch and starting over just because I feel like I effed things up, which I'm pretty sure I did F things up. But I'm just letting it roll. Let it roll until... Let it just, just let it roll. Oh, Jesus. Okay. It's just a dead body, right? Am I right? He is dead, right? God, I hope so. Hope everything in here is dead. That's what I'm hoping for. What do you got in here? Various commands may have been given from here. Oh, okay. It's like a command center. Whoa, what? The albinoid description. A creature which is created by injecting the T-virus into the genes of a salamander. Characteristics. What the fuck? Similar to an abnormal amphibian. An albinoid's body will change as it grows with age. That is a weird looking whatever. When young, an albinoid is small in size, but it can grow to over seven feet in a very short time frame. Oh, is that the thing that has the long arms, maybe? They possess high mobility and are able to discharge electricity. These characteristics are non suitable when they are underwater if they're in their adult form. Oh, okay. So it's not something we've encountered yet, but that gives us our first look at something we are 100% going to encounter. Because, spoiler alert, the game shows you things. Yes, grenade rounds. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. That's beautiful. It's beautiful. That's beautiful. It's true. And so are these motherfucking herbs. Because I motherfucking need them to. I'm going to eat you. Mix them. Eat them. Mostly because we need some. I'm only in the yellow, but you know what? Yellow is better than where we were. Which was in the red, about to die. Oh, look, an army proof symbol thing. So now we have two of our... Wait, what? Biohazard breakout in the bioexpin room. Switch the security monitor. Yeah, sure. Okay. Um... What are we doing? I'm not entirely sure what we're doing. Are we just seeing what's in the room? Are we supposed to find something in here, or are we just looking around? I don't know. Oh, shit. I was just... M oh, I see. Yes, resume using the camera. I'm supposed to zoom in on things. I get it. So I press square to zoom in on him? Yeah, okay. He seems to be dead. Resume the camera, yes. Now that I know I'm supposed to examine things with square, let's do that. What else we got in here? What's that? It's a picture of a skeleton. There's a number. The number is 116. 116. 116. Not sure what that's going to be for. Wait, what? The bio experiment room has finished ventilating. Oh. Cool. The pass number door lock system has been enabled. Oh. Okay. Cool. 116. Oh, shit. You're alive. Of course you are. Because, what the fuck, right? And yes, I'm not going to use my grenade launcher on a single zombie. God damn it. Don't you dare. Although I might have to, because I'm about to use up the rest of my ammo. Damn it. Should have just used a grenade launcher in the first place. God damn it. Well, whatever. Sometimes you can only use what you have the grenade launcher was better than that. 
Where you at, bitch? Burn. Alright, well. Nice waste of resources. The lock has been released. Oh, wait, where does this door go? This door go- Oh, this door goes that way. Actually. That's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea, if I do say so myself. There's nothing left. Ah. <sighs> Somehow, someway, man, we have survived through some shit today, man. We have survived through some shit. I just wanted to hit up the, uh, the item box. I don't know if I'm going to save it quite yet, but I am going to hit up the item box because I'm running out of space, mostly. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the main reason. We're going to put this away until we actually head back over to where we need it. I'm going to keep both card keys for now. I'm going to keep my grenade launcher and the ammo. I'm putting the handgun away. I'm putting these away because we don't need those right now. Um, the ink ribbons, we will use them. But um, eh, I'll hold on to them, actually, because I don't know if I'm going to use this save point or another save point to end off this recording sesh. So I'll keep them with me. Um, actually, was there anything else in there? There's the fire extinguisher. And what else? There's still the case, but we need a lockpick for that. Fire extinguisher the case of the hemostatic. Okay, we're not heading back to the dude to heal him yet, I don't think. So, let's head over to that room, 1126. I want to do that now, so I don't forget the number. Because if I skip, if I end off my recording session now, I will not remember 1126. Unless I, obviously, watch the episode back or write it down and remember to look at it before I start it up. So let's just head over there first. Um... Speaking of over there, how, where, how, what do we do to get over there again? If I go down the stairs, then we're on the first floor. We want to go... That was the palace. Wait, I want to go... There we go, first floor. So we go down the stairs, we'll be there. Which is the hallway we need to be in. But we have to go by the dogs to do that. But I think that's the only way to go down there, unless I go all the way around. So let's just go. Let's, let's man up. Fucking go for it. Fuck your dogs. Fuck your dogs. Whew, Shakim. Shakim the dog. Shakim. Alright, we're good. Let's get up in here. Do some she. So it's funny because I this this staircase existed earlier and I completely ignored it and didn't go up there, but I'm guessing if I would have gone up here. Oh. Okay. Silver card key, useless for the rest of the game. Fair enough. But I didn't go up here earlier for... I really don't have an excuse why I didn't go up here. I just didn't go. But now I'm curious what was up here. The doorknob is missing. Can't open it. Well, then. That's useless. Useless door with no doorknob. 1126. Don't forget. Any zombies in here? I have no idea. Wait, what's this? Is this a notepad? Stationary and related supplies. There's nothing left to useful. Fine. I don't want your stationary anyway. Your stationary can remain stationary for all I care. So if I would have come in here earlier, this number pad would not have been usable, I'm assuming. And there's the fucking crossbow! Oh. Oh, how you probably yelled at me. Oh, oh, oh. Memo on the pass number. The emergency door lock system in the biology experimentation room can be released with the four digit pass number. I hope you haven't forgotten about that already. I have just received an order from the system administrator requesting to us to change the password periodically. What bothers me is that you often lose port memos, pass numbers, or even chemicals. So in the attempt to solve the problem, I came up with an idea, you know, the red human skeleton picture at the back of the biology experiment room. I've decided to use the number sign on the picture as the pass number. If you happen to lose the memo, just look at the picture. Well, I don't think you would ever need to use the emergency pass number anyway, but just in case, you know, you know, take it. Yay. That would have been the most two useful things ever to have... I don't know. Yesterday. Literally. And episode-wise, it would have been yesterday, I'm pretty sure. Anyway, let's put in the goddamn number. One. One. Two. Fucking six. Son of a bitch. Suck a dick.
Man, I you the fact that I just found the bow gun makes me so excited and so pissed off at myself all at the same time. Why didn't I check up the stairs first? Ugh. Experimental objects may have been put inside. That's fine. Experiment all way. Experiment away. Acid rounds. Tasty. Yeah, see, now we're starting to load up on weapons. This game is going to be my bitch. It's cracked. Maybe something escaped through the crack? Probably. He's already dead. Does he have anything cool on him? No. Not even a memo. Not even a memo, bro. There's got to be something in here, right? Nothing useful. Nothing useful. Can we at least go through this door? Why did I press that button? Um, this is not a door, apparently. This is just something that's going to be working right now. I can't open it. Okay. We take the picture, then? We do take the picture. And I know it's Oh, fuck! Detected. Level three. That was, uh, some bullshit. Do I fight this thing? Oh, mother fucker. Wait, what? I wonder where the creature escaped to. Does it matter? All that matters is that he released some fucking poison up in here. Oh my god. Apparently it does matter. Get me the fuck out of here. Wait, what's the timer for? Do I gotta get out of the prison building? No idea. Either way, let's get the fuck out of the prison building, man. Thought this was where we, where we needed the picture, though. Oh, we just need to get out the side of that door. I got it. Fair enough. Okay, well, whatever. Okay, well, that was uh, uh, a legit funky scream there for a second because he did fucking shit, man. Fucking shit. All right. Um, Where was that room? It's that room over there, which is on the first floor, but uh, we could go this way. I ain't scared. Maybe we could pick up that thing on the ground over here, too. The one over by the dogs. Now that I have the rocket launcher or the grenade launcher, I was thinking about fighting this thing, but I think I'll. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I think I'll avoid this thing for now, even though I would really love to defeat it. Although, I don't know if it'll be. Po uh, not possible, but necessary to defeat it. You can let me know if it's necessary. He's probably just an obstacle you don't need to worry about. I'd rather get rid of these dogs, though. Fuck. Got him. Alright. I wasted a grenade there, but whatever, dude. They're dead. Pick up whatever this is now. Oh, look, more bow and arrows. Okay, well, whatever. Fuck it. They're dead. That's all that matters. I don't mind. Now we can actually look around this area safely. That's what I really wanted to do, actually. This is what I was actually hoping for. There... An old tank is being displayed here. This could be suited to Alfred's taste. Who's Alfred? Alfred. Who's Alfred? Do we know an Alfred? Do I know an Alfred? Something tells me this tank... Not going to stay idle for the rest of this game. The way, it, the way it's set up and the fact that we can acknowledge it as a thing that looks useful, it may find its use before this game is over. Alright, so... Okay. Um, we're just going this way, right? Yeah. Right. This way? Sorry. Not that way. This way. Getting all disorientated by the map a.k.a. not the camera to being able to move. Fixed camera angles for the lose win. Oh, god damn it. There was no zombie in here before. Or, actually, there was, right? Fuck, get off me. Fuck off. I don't need your shit right now, son. I don't need your shit right now, son. I should use the crossbows against those guys, and I will. I just didn't want to right there. There's an ad. There's a picture was hung here. Guess which picture? This one. Now what? It's something. The golden key. That's going to probably open up the golden doors inside of the palace. It's a diorama model at mo uh, diorama modeled after this facility. There's a hole to put something in. I'm assuming it's not for dicks. It's a square shape, probably not made for to stick your dick in. I don't really have anything to stick in the hole, though. Squ what did it say? Square-shaped hole? It's secure with a simple lock. Okay, so there's another cabinet here. Where the fuck are we going to get a lock pick, man? Memorial plate. There is something wrong right now. Dedicated to the training facility's completion. Alfred Ashford. Okay. It's a diorama modeled after this facility. There's a hole to put something in. Is that, I'm assuming it's that square hole, right? I 
think. I don't know. I can't tell. Um, Alfred is the dude that shot at us with the sniper rifle, right? Is that him? Am I forgetting that was him? That was his name. I forgot his name. That's all. Anyway, I'm going to wrap up the episode here, I think. So in the next episode of Let's Play Resident Evil Code Veronica, we're probably going to head back to the palace and use this golden key. That's what I presume. I can't expect us to use it, do something different, but then again, you never know. So, hope you guys enjoyed the episodes that are all back to back to back. This should be about three episodes worth, I hope. And, uh, yes, I'm going to be busy this weekend. That's why I recorded all these all at once. So, f sorry if I didn't use your feedback on anything or you yelled at me for something I missed. But, uh, it is what it is. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.